Hey there! Welcome to Life Noggin. Kale? No thank you. Bananas? Hard pass. It's fine to not like some foods. As a little kid, you probably pouted about eating the healthy things on your plate. Now that you've grown up, you've probably gotten over your hatred of things like this giant salad monster. But what if you never ate fruits or vegetables? Fruits and veggies are full of many vitamins, minerals, and nutrients, but for the sake of time, we're gonna focus on some main ones. Vitamin A, B6, and C, folic acid, potassium, magnesium, and antioxidants all found in produce. What would happen to your body if you cut all of those out and became deficient. Well, let's go from the top down, starting at your head. Your hair would be dried and frayed. Your eyesight may get worse, and you could even lose your nighttime vision. Vitamin C deficiency can cause your gums to turn purple, and you may lose some teeth. This deficiency can also prevent wounds from healing properly, so you'd likely have scabs and scars covering your body. Mentally, depression, confusion, and irritability can all surface when you're deficient in vitamin B6 or folic acid. Moving down the body, a lack of potassium can lead to various heart problems like irregular heartbeat, and your cardiovascular system isn't the only one struggling without fruits and veggies. The gastrointestinal tract that helps you digest food would be going haywire as well. We're talking nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, pretty much the opposite of a good day. Your immune system would be pretty shot due to the lack of vitamins A, B6, and C, as well as magnesium, so you'd likely get sick a lot. Your nervous system would also struggle, possibly leading to neurodegenerative diseases, which really don't sound great. You'd experience muscle spasms due to the lack of potassium and magnesium, so prepare for a lot of 3 a.m. Charlie horses. That's actually just my horse named Charlie, but he always wakes me up at 3 a.m. And if you're cutting out fruits and vegetables, the last thing you need is someone else disrupting your sleep. Seriously, Charlie, can you just get out of here for a second? Various vitamins and minerals help with energy production, so if you lose those, you'd be pretty tired all the time. Many fresh fruits and vegetables contain antioxidant phytochemicals that are believed to be anti-cancer, anti-aging, and anti... well a lot of other diseases. So without these antioxidants, you can look older and be at a higher risk of getting cancer and various other conditions. So yeah, none of this sounds fun. All of these symptoms would happen at different paces for different people, depending on how else they receive these nutrients in the rest of their diet. Some things like vitamin C deficiency can do some serious damage in just one month. And if you're thinking that you can just make up for all these deficiencies with vitamins and supplements, it's not that easy. While supplements may provide you with similar vitamins and minerals to those found in produce, they leave out things like fiber, flavonoids, antioxidants, and phytochemicals that all work together in fruits and vegetables to make them so healthy. And and while it may surprise you, the effectiveness of vitamins in general is actually quite debated in the scientific community. One thing that's not debated, whether or not fruits and vegetables are good for you. Seriously, just eat them. Don't be like Triangle Bob over here, I have to pay someone to shove broccoli in his mouth every day. It's very sad. So, do you have a favorite fruit or vegetable? Do you actually eat them? Let us know in the comment section below. Or tell us, what should we talk about next? If you enjoyed this video, then make sure you check out the video we did on what would happen if you never stopped eating. One recent study found a significant relationship between added sugar consumption and an increased risk of dying from cardiovascular disease when observing participants for over 14 years. As always, my name is Blocko. This has been Life Noggin. Don't forget, to keep on thinking.